What up? This your boy Zare from FNA, you know. And um, this is gonna be a mix in the master tutorial on Adobe Audition 3.0. And this is my Mercy, you know, session right here. You can go listen to Mercy, listen to the quality, see if you like it. This is the settings I use for Mercy. First, you wanna mute the all the noise that you don't need unneeded noise. Go in. Take all the breaths out, all those breaths that, and all that. This is called cleaning your vocals. You don't need the breaths; it can like mess up your mix if you don't do this. So what you want to do is highlight all of it. You want to go to Amplify, Fade, Process, Center Wave. Then you want to go to Dynamics Processing. You want to go to Compander, and then you want to go to Deesser Light, and then. You want to go to classic softening. You let it do its thing right there. Then you go back to dynamics process one more time. And you go all the way down. Click wrap presence. Okay. Then you go to multiband compressor. Kill the harshness at the bottom. Okay. Then you go to it again. Multiband compressor. Then you go to de -esser again. You need these to take these S's out. You, they're not needed to make them lighter then you go back to it one more time and you go to classical master okay okay we're done with amplitude and compression right now then we go to filter and EQ FFT filter excuse my phone you go to killer subhomics and then you go to it again you go to mastering heavy and wide okay we're gonna go to it again click the deesser Go to graphic equalizer. We're gonna go to lead vocal presence and clarity right there. Okay. Now we're gonna go to parametric equalizer, generic generic high pass. It's gonna kill everything that's in the background. It's gonna get your main vocals only. Then we're gonna go to scientific filters. We're gonna his cut above ten, whatever that is. <laughs> then we're gonna go to Special. No, we're gonna go to reverb, studio reverb, mastering reverb. You look for mastering reverb. It's right here. Okay. And now we're gonna to go to special, and we're gonna click mastering. We're gonna use this preset called subtle clarity. We're gonna bring this up to 3.6. 3.6, right? Here. I'm gonna bring this reverb amount all the way down to zero. Okay. Now we're gonna go to direct X effects right here. We're gonna go to isotope ozone four. We're gonna use CD master to give it that nice little sound. And if, if you're wondering why my vocals are looking so fat, it's because I did this already. Excite vocals is gonna be on like 45 or something. You're gonna bring it to 40.3. But I had already mixed this. So I'm just gonna, you know, do it again to show you how to do it. So yeah, so that's just, that's pretty much it on the mixing right there. <sighs> so now I have waves, but I don't use it. It's right there. I'm gonna, I might make a tutorial on how to use waves. I might not. You never know. I use waves sometimes, not every time. So now you're gonna go to the multi track. And you can mess with the EQ if you want to. Right here, you can power it on. Click the EQ button, and you can mess with the high, mids, and the lows if you want to. But it is up to you. And you can play with your, you know, volume or whatever if you want it. Just get it how you want it. But this is what I used on Mercy. So go listen to it. I will leave a link in the description or an annotation. Rate, comment, like, subscribe. You know, tell me what you think. Leave a video response of how this worked for you, if you liked it or not. Okay, and that's about it. F and E.